the title of this mini podcast is Crossroads. I came across this quote from Albert Einstein. I must be willing to give up what I am to become what I will be. It's a powerful idea to reflect on. What I am, for most of us, is the person we made up and got comfortable with. When we begin to get uncomfortable with what I am, there's usually a fork in the road presented. One fork leads to more of the same. Let's call it same shit, different zip code. And the other leads to what I will be. You'll know which road you're going to head down when you make this decision. What to take with you. Reminds me of a story. A longtime friend and his wife were moving from upstate New York to Florida. They had a cozily decorated home featuring early American decor. They decided to have an auction of all their furniture and many other household items so they could start from scratch when they arrived in Florida. When I visited their lovely new home, the only things that remained the same were the pictures of their grandchildren on the new refrigerator. This uncomfortable period of standing at the fork has been labeled as falling apart. The patterns that make up who you think you are start coming unglued. The road most people take at this point is the one that takes you backward. On this route, you begin to buy into the I can have my cake and eat it too illusion. People usually seek more stuff at this point. They become more superficial. This is an effort to add more to their personal illusions so they can finally feel like they're enough. The mistake they make is simply mathematical. They add when they should subtract. Most people eventually figure it out that adding will never fill the hole in their soul. And then they take the other fork. It's what's been referred to as the return movement. A portion of our life is spent amassing and adding layers and layers to our image, sort of like bumper stickers. The return movement is removing the layers to find out who we really are underneath it all. The uncomfortable feeling we get at the fork is a signal and an invitation for us to go deeper. Many of us don't RSVP. Underneath all the layers of addition is the foundation of our core, the animating life force that is who we are without all the additions. Once we make that discovery, the fork that most others take becomes the road less traveled for us. You'll find your what I will be when you drop what you were hanging on to for dear life. Life gets simpler when we give up carrying around the backpack labeled what I am. All the best, John.